CBS Young and the Restless Spoilers, Friday, September 9th, 2022. Chloe is the mediator presenting Chelsea and Sally for the real Adam and hoping they don't expect anything from this man. Stay awake. Billy was not pleased when Adam stepped up to the position of CEO of Javit, a position that no one had ever reached out but Jack. Does he want to make Adam his heir? When Jack kept a secret to himself, he also did not receive much support from his family. But that's the way he chose, under pressure for a while. But the plan was completed perfectly, not revealed. Abby's very tired. She sees Chance determined to put Victor in jail, which makes her stand between the two factions not easy at all. She wanted to end this quickly. Chloe sees Sally obsessed with Adam's love, something many women have experienced. Chloe's an outsider, so she has the objective views. She wished that Sally should be sober. Don't rush to make bad decisions. Jack had to hold an emergency meeting for members of the Abbott family to explain Adam's appointment to the CEO position, but he had no intention of doing so. Jack thinks he has no reason to do it. He wants to do it, and he just does it. Jack has the right to add personnel, appoint anyone to any position that he feels is lacking, and better to help the corporation. Meanwhile, Victor tells Nikki that they should focus on escaping the prison. She shouldn't interfere in Diane's life. At this stage, they should avoid causing more hatred as much as possible. But Nikki defends her point of view that she must defeat all the enemies. Diane is the one she hates the most and can't let her father do what she wants. Phyllis, Nikki, and Talia are on their own. They just need time to get Diane out of Genoa.